Soft-Coated Wheaton Terrier The Irish Soft-Coated Wheaton Terrier is a dog breed native to Ireland. The first mentions of a soft-haired terrier date from the 19th century and were used as versatile farm dogs. Recognized in the middle of the century, the breed was exported to the United States. Irish short-haired terriers are medium-sized to large terrier dogs with a rustic and active appearance. The head is long, well-proportioned, with a pronounced stop. Ears of small to medium size are carried forward. Well-attached, the tail is worn cheerfully. It is sometimes shortened by a third of its length. The coat is wheaten with long, silky hairs. This video is partially sponsored by DelvixGarden.com, your source for high-quality food supplements and personal care products at low prices. This company has a range of premium products for your health, beauty, and personal care, including organic pine pollen, ceremonial grade matcha, medicinal herbs, hair dye shampoo, and plant-based protein for weight loss. There are links in the description. Kindly visit their store and use the coupon code FIRST20% to get 20% discount on your first order. They are very smart dogs and are easy to train. They love people, and they rarely have aggression issues if obtained from a reputable breeder. In general, the soft-haired Irish Terrier is an intrepid, affectionate, and faithful companion dog breed. Irish short-haired terriers were bred in Ireland for over 200 years to be an all-purpose farm dog whose duties included herding, watching, and guarding livestock, as well as vermin hunting and killing. They share a common ancestry with the Kerry Blue Terrier and the Irish Terrier, but were not owned by the gentry. In Ireland, they were commonly referred to as the poor man's wolfhound. Their tails used to be docked, to avoid taxes and were often kept to a specific size. Despite its long history, the Wheaton was not recognized as a breed in Ireland by the Irish Kennel Club until 1937. In 1943, the British Kennel Club recognized the breed in the UK as well. The first Wheatons were exported to Lydia Vogel in the United States in the 1940s, but serious interest in the breed took another 10 years to develop. The Soft-Coated Wheaton Terrier Club of America Incorporated was established in 1962, seven years after the formation of the Soft-Coated Wheaton Terrier Club of Great Britain. In the 1970s, the first Irish short-haired terriers were imported into Australia by Anubis Kennels. In 1973, they were recognized by the American Kennel Club. The recent importation of Irish-style dogs has improved and broadened the gene pool. The American Herding Breed Association, AHBA, accepted the Wheaton in the 1990s, at which point members of the breed were allowed to participate in its herding capability tests and trials. Today, Wheatons compete in obedience, agility, and tracking, and are occasionally used in animal-assisted therapy as well. The Soft-Coated Wheaton Terrier Club of America Incorporated is a member of the American Kennel Club, which protects and advances the interests of the breed and guards against commercial exploitation. It serves breeders, owners, competition organizers, and prospective owners. Appearance Soft-coated Wheaton Terrier puppies have dark coats of red, brown, mahogany, or white. Their muzzles and ears may be black or dark brown. The reddish-brown puppy coat gradually grows out to nearly white before maturing into a Wheaton-colored coat as they get older. The adult coat typically matures by three years and may contain black, white, or darker brown guard hairs in addition to the lighter Wheaton-colored hair. If adults ever have skin injuries, the resulting hair growth, wound hair, will be the dark color of their puppy coat before it eventually grows out to the wheat color. It may also come out to a molten chocolate color, either white or milky colored fur. 
The soft-coated Wheaton Terrier is a medium-sized dog, which ranges on average from 17 to 20 inches in height, and about 30 to 45 pounds in weight. The breed has a square structure and is well-built. Their soft, silky hair does not shed like most dogs. Like human hair and poodle hair, it keeps growing. They do need trimming and should be brushed and combed once a day to avoid mats. Temperament The soft-coated Wheaton Terrier is an energetic and playful dog. It requires patience and consistent positive training. Harsh methods will often result in fear and or aggression. A positive, even-handed approach works best with this intelligent yet headstrong terrier. It's an enthusiastic greeter and will often jump up to lick a person's face, commonly referred to as the Wheaton greeting. Wheatons are considered less scrappy than other terriers, but are lively and can be more active than many other breeds. For this reason, these dogs do best when they are exercised regularly. They are cool weather dogs and can become easily overheated in hot weather. If socialized with cats and puppies, they may get along fine with them. If not, care should be taken in introducing them to cats, as the breed has a very strong prey drive because of its vermin hunting origin. Wheatons are friendly and loving pets and get along well with other dogs if properly socialized. Wheatons are very protective of their families and although they may bark and alert at strangers, they rarely get aggressive. Many Wheaton owners thus say they make for great watchdogs, but poor guard dogs. Soft-coated Wheaton Terriers are a great dog for children and are generally friendly towards them. Health and Lifespan Soft-coated Wheaton Terriers are generally a long-lived breed, although they are susceptible to various heritable diseases. They tend to be affected by two protein-wasting conditions. Protein losing nephropathy, PLN, where the dogs lose protein via the kidneys, and protein losing enteropathy, PLE, where the dogs fail to fully absorb protein in their digestive tracts, causing it to pass in their stool. Both PLN and PLE are potentially fatal, but if caught early enough, the condition can be managed with strict dietary changes and pharmaceuticals. Laboratory tests can aid in diagnosing PLN and PLE, therefore Wheaton owners should check their country's advised testing protocols. Research suggests that PLE and PLN are more prevalent in female dogs, and often happen in occurrence with PLE following diagnosis of PLN. While a genetic predisposition has been suggested, an unknown mode of inheritance remains. Research programs, mainly in the United States and United Kingdom, are looking for answers. Other Wheaton health issues are malformation of the kidney during development, inflammatory bowel disease, Addison's disease, and cancer. Some soft-coated Wheaton Terriers can suffer from food and environmental allergies and can be prone to developing the skin disease atopic dermatitis. Potential owners of Wheaton Terriers should discuss health issues with a breeder before deciding to get a puppy. Thank you for watching the video till the end. Now it's your turn. What dog breed do you have or would you like us to talk about? Please let us know. And remember to like the video and subscribe to the channel to help us establish our presence on YouTube.